Hey guys, it's Darlene and welcome to my channel. Alright, so today's video is the first video. There'll be a few and y'all probably know what it is. It is the Nordstrom's anniversary sale preview. So the magazine came out. Um, although I do look through this magazine, what I do for you guys, for myself, is I look through the entire anniversary sale online so that maybe you don't have to. Uh, I will have everything in the description box broken down by category. One thing about me is I don't just list a bunch of stuff, okay? I list the things that um, I either need or want. <laughs> there is a difference. Or things that I have had in the past. Started, let me just say a few things. Because <laughs> we get frustrated, I do as well. Things are going to sell out. They always do. Sometimes it's things I want, sometimes it's things you want. They will sell out. Um, what I would suggest doing is, number one, go through your closet and see what you need. Needs. Needs first. See, are my black jeans still black? <laughs> or are they faded? I look to see, are my cardigans faded? Do I need a black cardigan? Am I missing something in my wardrobe? The basics. Start there. Um, and then, um, if you're not sure of your size, put both of them in your wish list. And uh, if you have a chance, you could go to the store, find out what size AG jeans you, you know, you got plenty of time um, to find out what size wit and wisdom is. Does it do wit and wisdom jeans run big? Yes, they do. I'm nodding. I've put a note in here. So when you're looking, you'll see that I've said um, that they do run big. They so size down. Wish list. You can create your wish list now. So Click on what, any link that you like, start creating your wish list. Uh, so I'm going to start with dresses just because I love dresses. Yeah, I'm going to be looking down and I apologize, but I have everything on my phone so that I can show you. Okay. So the first dress is by French Connection, um, a super cute mini dress. The first one, although a mini dress, fret not because the next one I'm about to show you is very similar, but in a midi style. Um, and I will be buying both of them. Um, the first is more of a mini style uh, dress with the gold buttons. Um, I love this look. I love that you could throw a moto. I love that you could wear it now. Um, you know me, I love transition pieces. And then I love that you could wear it with, as it gets colder, you could wear it with tights, over the knee boot, a moto jacket. It'd be very The cute. next one, is a more uh, conservative city style. Again, something I could wear now. This one is by Maggie London, and as you can see, it's more, um, more, you know, it's a completely different style, but still has that same vibe, right? With the gold buttons and the black, and I think it's really cute. I just love the classic style of it. This is a dress that will go forever. Years and years, 10 years from now, you have this dress, it's going to still be in style. And the other thing that I love about it, well, two things. Belt, it's belted and it has pockets. I mean, really, what more could you want, right? The next one is, I actually have this dress in a long sleeve version. It's very crepey and drapey and beautiful. I love the color neckline, a little bit of V, flutter sleeves. Again, a great transition piece. I like that they came out with a short sleeve. This is by Steve Madden, by the way. The next one is by Halogen. This is a contrast strap midi dress. Um, I like the idea of contrast strapping. Um, so it's black and then it has the white straps. Uh, so I like that contrast. Again, this also has pockets, which girl loves pockets anything with pockets square neckline works for me but I really like it and I think it's very cute now this dress is similar to a couple of the others that I just showed you but what I love about this one is the stitching detail so this comes in three colors um, I'm gonna get the black with white stitching um, I love it it's almost that very cargo-esque kind of dress um, they I know they have a navy and white and then there's a lighter color. Now for those of you that know I um, love Julia Jordan dresses. This first one um, again a dress with pockets it cinches at the smallest part of the waist. I love the colors um, a floral motif. It has the flutter sleeves that do go down a little bit longer which I like that particular dress and that is one I'm getting. All of the ones that I've mentioned so far I'm getting. 
Uh, the next one for Julia Jordan is a short abstract dress. So if you're looking for something, this is a great dress for right now, like for a tropical vacation. I love all the blues. This is, I'm on the fence on this one. I think it's a beautiful dress. It's a matter of do I need it. Um, the sleeves also go down longer so that if this part is something that you want to hide, there it goes. This one is by Steve Madden. This is similar to the Julia Jordan, so if the price point of Julia Jordan is not in your price point, um, I would suggest this one. I love that it's, I love that it has the blue uh, with the flowers. I love that you can wear it now. I love, I can see this with a jean jacket and a pair of booties, easy as can be. This one is by Chelsea 28. I love this. This is one that is definitely more fall winter esque. Um, I love the colors. Uh, I love the sheerness of the sleeves. Uh, it looks like it cinches at the smallest part of the waist. Uh, but what makes this one, it looks like it's fully lined. What makes this one, though, really unique is the back. I love the tie detail in the back. It's that little something extra. Uh, and I love this. Um, it, it will look cute with a pair of black heels. It'll also look cute with a pair of booties or a pair of boots. Uh, back to Julia Jordan, here's another short version. Um, this one it has more of a striped detail, even though they're polka dots and, and kind of wavy things, but it goes in a striped version. Um, I won't be getting this one, but if I wanted to show you. Also by Chelsea 28 is this, anytime this girl can get a green dress, she's going to do it. I'm obsessed by green. I think this is beautiful. It has a nice V. This is a sleeveless dress. Um, again, so you could easily wear it now, but it will transition beautifully into fall and spring. I just love the colors. The next Julia Jordan dress is something that I have that's very, very, very similar. So although I'm going to recommend it to you, it is not one I'm going to pick up. I have so many of her dresses. This is too similar to one that I already own. Uh, this is a long sleeve. I love the brown and blue, the brown and navy mix. I think that's gorgeous, tie detail. Um, the last Julia Jordan dress is also one that I have almost identical. Identical. Um, the colors are identical. The long sleeves are identical. This just has a puffy sleeve and pair of boots or booties. Perfection. And again, I have this dress. Very similar anyways. We're going to slide into denim but still be in dresses. Uh, denim is very, very hot. Uh, different, uh, not just in jeans, but also in skirts and dresses. So I want to try a few. I love this one by uh, Rails. Um, it's absolutely adorable. I, I love the vest look of the top. And then it has a skirt, it has pockets, it has a front slit. I think it's just gorgeous. Now, will it work on my bike? I have no idea. That's why I buy it and then I try do a try on. The next is also denim. We're going to go shorter and we're going to go darker in the denim. I love this. This is by um, this name, Avec Les Fils. Don't correct me. I have no idea. No, you can correct me if you want. I love this. I love that it has long sleeves, slightly flared at the sleeve, cinched in at the waist, and then flared out. It is a mini skirt. I'm getting that one as well. And then, and then the last one in dresses and skirts is a this is the only skirt that I found. What I love about it is uh, that it is a jean material. It's a dark material. It's pleated. You can see with this picture, there is a matching jacket and I will be getting that as well because I think the outfit together, it's hard because she's crossing her arms so you, I cannot see them as separates. Um, but I, I, I'm gonna buy the whole outfit. I'm gonna buy the outfit. It's a drop front and then pleated. Um, and then it looks like it has a slit. Super cute though. Um, coats, jackets, blazers, those kind of things. So I absolutely live in freezing cold weather now with snow, so I own a lot of jackets. I was not looking for a puffer jacket. If I was looking for a puffer jacket, I love this one from Bernardo. Um, they have really good quality um, puffer jackets, and I think this is really cute, and it comes in like three or four colors. Um, with regards to trench coats that are wool or wool material, love this red. I have a green that I wear, and every time I wear it, I get a compliment. Do they have that 
in the sale right now? No, I wish they did. But I love this pop of red and I do not have a red and I feel like this would be so beautiful for the holidays if you're wearing like a winter white and popping the red uh, coat or you're wearing an all black outfit and you pop the red coat. It's gorgeous. It will go with everything. Which is a black one and I can't remember who it's by. Black trench uh, wool. This one is going in my cart because I need it. There is a need. I needed a black. Um, if you want to go a little shorter, um, because you don't feel like doing like a longer trench, this one is really cute. Uh, this one is uh, in a camel, and they also are a toffee. They're calling it a toffee. They also have it in a black as well. Um, now, speaking of winter white, I have a winter white trench. I wear it all the time, and I absolutely love it. So this is, although not the exact one that I have, one that looks very chic and very beautiful, and you'd be surprised how many times you would wear a winter white. All right, one blazer, um, because this girl has her favorite blazers, right? That's a great thing. If you can, and I didn't find any moto jackets, blank NYC. There's another one that I will look, but I just didn't say anything. Uh, this blazer, I love it. It's a faux leather blazer, and it's a, um, very uh, dressy, if you will, although you could dress it down. I mean, when I say dress it down, you could wear it with jeans. Easy. But I really like the look of this, uh, at least online. Um, I, 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 yeah, I really love it. Double breasted, um, belt, you know, it's got a belt tied to it. Uh, so cinch in that waist. Or a lot of times what I do is I'll take their belts off and I put my own belt fun uh, for a little more hardware bling if you will um, but I I like this I, I love leather pieces so uh, this was the one and it does come in black and it does come in brown as well so this is the one blazer that uh, I'm going in my car to sweaters cardigans um, it's really funny because this one I'm showing you you're like Darlene you're wearing it I am not but boy does it look very similar this one is by Caslon. The one I'm wearing is by Loft. I live in New England now, so I love uh, that coastal uh, fashion. I love coastal fashion. I love stripes, and that, by the way, they're, it's very big. It's a whole page in here on, on stripes and coastal. And I love this because it's a thicker material than the one this is very lightweight it's only 70 degrees today it's why i'm wearing it um but i love this and so yes that's going in my cart it has the same same concept i absolutely right. love the it the other striped sweater that i'm obsessed by and it is uh by madewell so it's the same you have that polo style version the other one with madewell i love that it's a it's a um, winter white with what appears to be black uh, it could be a navy. It's hard for me to tell because my eyes are like dead. Next one is by Treasure and Bond. Uh, this is one of those where I'm going to experiment. I don't know how I feel about this sweater. I like the colors. Do I like them together? Is it going to feel good? Am I going to like it? I don't know. But it's interesting. I don't have anything like it. Colors and there's two different blocked patterns, if you will. Next sweater by Vince Camuto. This girl loves pink year round. Love it love it love it um i like that it has a slight it's not a bell sleeve it is a, but it is a slightly white sleeve but not bell but i love the bright pink and, and i will be jumping from cardigan to sweater cardigan winter white i love a winter white i don't have this and i like them with pockets so it's gorgeous that one is by uh i think the nordstrom brand itself uh the next one is a black a lighter weight cardigan. I like to have that when I'm in the house, you know, just, you know, it's a little chilly and you want something to snuggle with. Halogens, uh, I've, I've had many of these throughout the years. Um, this one is sort of a shirt top. This one's sort of a top slash sweater. I love this. I think this may sell out. It's by Treasure and Bond. It is an ivory. It has almost an eyelet detail. I love that it has a little rough, like a little ruffle uh, hemline. Um, I love that it's sleeveless. Uh, I think it's gorgeous. I could see this with a pair of jeans 
and it looked beautiful. I can see this with um, a silk skirt and it looked gorgeous. Um, I just, there's something about it that just speaks to me. This one is by Halogen. I've had this throughout the years. Um, it's a lightweight sweater. I like it and want it. it it's many colors, but in this uh, sort of tannish color, um, I like that there's a little button detail, just speaks for interest. It's lightweight, so it's a great layering piece. Okay, tops, there's just a couple. Um, I, you know, there may be more later, but right now, um, there's just not a whole lot that I'm, you know, over the moon about. Um, but these two, these two are both by Vince Camuto, and um, I like both of them. I will not be buying both of them. This is the one I will be getting. I'm going to show you both. Um, I own something very similar. Here's something very similar that I own. This one was from Ann Taylor. I love it so much. Um, but I love this, uh, I love a hot pink. This girl loves pink. Um, I love the V-line. I love the cuff sleeve uh, of, of this one. And I think it's beautiful. Be great for work. Be great for date night. It's beautiful. Now, if you want it, uh, a little bit more embellishment, if you will, this one has a ruffled neckline, sheer sleeves with um, a little flared, a little flared, it's cuffed, but then it flares out. Um, and I think that one's really cute as well. And that's by Vince Camuto. And then one state, just to throw this in here, has my, my, has the camisole that I own. Um, being that I have a prosthesis, there's a lot of times where I need to throw a cami on. I love this lace detail cami. Um, sometimes they're hard to find. And I love that this is back in stock and it'll last you forever. I mean, really. All right, shoes and boots. Love. Shoes and boots. This is where I just, I love everything. So shoes, boots, and booties. All right, let's start with this booty. This booty, actually, I vaguely remember, I feel like I saw this last year. And I feel like it sold out. Um, this is by 42 Gold, which is a brand I am not familiar with, so I cannot tell you if it's come from, I can't tell you anything other than I like it and it, and it looks very cool and, uh, very interesting and I love an open-toed booty. Um, I got these ones last year, but I love an open-toed booty. Same thing. Um, obviously it doesn't have a front zip, but I love an open-toed booty. Those are one of my favorite pair of booties. These are booties you'll, you could wear year round. Um, and I got them in the nude. I want to elongate the leg. Um, I can see wearing them with shorts, skirts, long skirts, short skirts, dresses, jeans, you name it. Uh, the next pair, love these by Karl uh, Lagerfeld. Uh, the, this green is gorgeous. And what I love and what it, it appears is that the shaft of the boot is higher than a booty. Um, so it's a booty, but the shaft is very similar to my Tory Burch's just have a higher shaft uh, than a traditional uh, so you can see that the shaft is bigger taller love I wish I don't understand why she only did it one time and every year I look and every year they're not there <laughs> um, because I would love to have those in a black love 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 but anyways it's okay this green is gorgeous it's unique it's not something I have, and um, I love the little, it looks like little gun metal, but it's hard for, or silver, it's very hard for me to tell from the picture. Little beads around um, the the toe bed. Um, so, very cute. That's in my cart. Um, okay, so Naturalizer, for the last three years, has come out, this boot, in some regard, okay? And the what makes it unique is that it has the black, with the brown. Uh, Blondo um, decided to create very similar to that. However, not with that heel. So that it does have a heel. Again, I live in Connecticut. So during the winter, my boots do have to, if to do it, to do, be an everyday boot, meaning I'm going out shopping, I'm not going to date night or something like that. I need a very low heel. I need a waterproof. And of course I always need it to be comfortable. So Blondo came out with uh, their version of it and it's a version of the Moto style. So it's a Moto boot with a very small heel. Uh, naturalizer. Love these. 
Now this is not an over the knee. Uh, I love the color. This one is that very nude um, uh, color and I really like it. Uh, there are other colors um, and I love naturalizer because they're super comfortable. Now this is a completely different now this is a true riding boot. The other one was a knee high. This one is a true riding boot, which is something that I've been looking for for two years. A good one. This is by Naturalizer. It's exactly what I'm looking for. Black, pure black. Um, it just hopefully will be comfortable. That's the whole idea. We, we need to make it comfortable. So I love it. It comes in the black and also a cinnamon brown, um, which is a beautiful, beautiful color. And again, naturalizer so should be comfortable okay now this last boot right here is by Dolce Vita I'm obsessed by this dark brown suede it's gorgeous I like the low heel pointed toe I think it's very 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 cute I'd like to have it in all three colors and you never know I'll get the first pair um, but I don't have a really rich chocolate brown and that's what that is and so I absolutely love that but it also ha is in a lighter brown or tan and then also black as well um, I am picking up a pair of sneakers I am obsessed these are not for winter or fall maybe fall but definitely for spring and summer I'm obsessed with because uh, there's a lot of walking sometimes you know we're heading to Cape Cod um, would have loved to get these before, but I, I'll be in Cape Cod when the sale is is going on um, it's a platform it's a white sneaker platform the I love the platform look of a pure white sneaker it looks amazing with shorts jeans skirts uh, dresses it's great Okay, you guys, jeans. Uh, jeans and pants and all of that. Uh, jeans. I'm a really simple girl. Um, I've mentioned this. Wit and Wisdom are my absolute favorite jeans in the Nordstrom's anniversary sale. Um, uh, some of my favorites are the boot cut, which is right here. We have the skinny black. So if your black jeans are looking a little, you know, not so black. They're great. They're, oh, why do I like them, by the way? In case you're new here, in case this is your first time following me, Wit and Wisdom's jeans has a thing called Absolution. I'm wearing a pair today. Again, it's only 70 degrees today, you guys. So this, this right here has stretch. And it's this little material. You will never, when you bend over, you are never going to show your crack. <laughs> you are never, and they're not going to stretch out, wear out. I've had some of them for years and years and years um and i love them um sometimes uh, a new like these ones have a raw hem to them and they're a little more distressed sometimes they'll come out with um some interesting pattern or interesting thing and then i'm like oh yes i have to have that or i'll just need to update something because i've had it for years like a pair of black ones uh the other pair is a straight leg uh so i will list all three for you and um that way uh, uh and then what you could do is under the nordstrom's anniversary Go to jeans, filter brand, and hit with wisdom, and you can see all the ones that they have on sale because they have quite, quite a few. The other pair that I'm going to try, and I've never tried this brand before, is Rails for jeans. Uh, I like this wide leg crop. I just do. I like that it's dark denim. Um, I like that it's um, a wide leg, but it's a short wide leg, cropped wide leg. Um, and uh, I just, I love the color of the denim. I think it's so easy to dress this up and it will show your booties um, off beautifully. And I love that there's a, uh, that it's a raw hem, but not distressed, just raw. Uh, I didn't find any pants um, at this point. Again, that could change. All right. Uh, let, all right, let's do beauty and then we'll do accessories. Beauty, as always, new faces on sale. Now, uh, they have the advanced facial new face. I don't want know what makes it advanced. Um, I haven't looked it up. I will look it up, um, and and I'll do my homework and see if if my, you know, I've 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 got a lot of microcurrent devices, y'all. Um, but uh, you know, this one, and I've said, and the mini is on sale as well. And I've said, now again, 
I don't know what the advanced means. Um, I don't know if that's just, uh, but it's almost a hundred dollars off. So you're planning on picking up, um, a microcurrent device. It's a good price. The mini is on there as well. It's a good price. Do they work? Yes. I've got a million videos, a million, <laughs> maybe not a million, but quite a few. This dry bar has a hot roller set. I haven't used hot rollers in a million years. I really want to try it and, um, I'll let you know what I think about it. Um, hair ties. Um, these, uh, I have a whole, at this point, I have a whole thing of the silk, that's what, by slip, silk by slip hair ties. I buy them every year in the Nordstrom sale. I've bought them for my daughters. I bought them for my daughter-in-law. I buy, buy, buy. Um, buy them when they're on sale. Uh, Kapari. Um, I have Kapari. I use Kapari all the time. Uh, it is a sunscreen. Uh, this one that they have is a kit. Uh, the price is great. Uh, and even though I don't need it right now, I'm buying it anyways because it's on sale. And I, that with that price point, yeah, I'm going to buy it. Um, I actually, the one that's in there is the yellow one. Um, the and it gives a beautiful glow. I put keep this one in here and when I'm wearing like um, off the shoulder or some you know something that's not a sweater I have this cute little curved little brush if I have room to list it I will um, but I'll put a little of this on here and then run it across my decollete and my arms and it just gives it's such a beautiful thing one of course it's sunscreen but number two it's just um, it gives a beautiful glow. I have it, all of my sunscreens for my body are by Kapari. So there you go. Hourglass. I typically don't buy a lot of makeup uh, in the Nordstrom's anniversary sale. It's usually I don't. If I do, I'm in the store and something grabs my attention. But right now, I did find something. It's called the Sculpt and Gloss Set by Hourglass. Uh, it comes with a lip liner and a uh, it's saying gloss, but it looks like a lipstick to me, but hey. Um, so I want to try it. Um, I've never tried Hourglass uh, lip stuff. I'm very particular, but we'll see. Um, the other thing that I use uh, for self-tanning, because I do self-tan, uh, I there's two products that I use. Um, when I want a very deep tan, but it's going to take overnight to do, I do St. Tropez. Uh, so they have their... Uh, set which I like because it's the big one and it's a little one so the travel size so you can take the travel size with you on vacation which is great all right uh, last in beauty um, is the Charlotte Tilbury setting spray I buy it every year so I buy the two pack and you can see this is my last bottle and by the time that I get my order in I will be perfectly fine and I'll be set for a whole year because two bottles last me a whole year um, and, uh, it, you know, depending on how often you use setting spray, it's the best. It's, uh, the airbrush flawless and, uh, it feels so good and it keeps your makeup looking great. That's it for beauty. I know there's just not a lot for me. Um, beauty typically isn't a big category for me. Uh, okay. So accessories, which would be like belt jewelry's purses. There are a, a belt by Kirk London. I'm going to, I'm going to just say Kirk G London. Cause I don't know how to Geiger Geiger. I don't know. I uh, love this. Um, I love both colors. I was like, great. They have it in black and they have it in a, um, like a natural. Um, a lot of those dresses, you know, this girl is going to belt and I love this. I can say it's quilted, it's gorgeous. And then I went and said, oh great, they have a patent leather one too. <laughs> so of course I want, I will be getting both. Uh, earrings, Bubble Bar has um, some of their cute earrings. Um, I actually own a, so I love the cute, fun earrings for summer. Um, you know, they have their uh, like bubbly or these ones are champagne but these ones are done in a silver I have the ones very similar to that in the gold um, so uh, I like that these ones are in a silver and then they also have the martini which I'm obsessed with the green olives I think they're fun they're whimsical they're cute 
I like them. What can I say? Uh, the next is a n couple necklaces. Uh, I can't remember who this one is by. Um, I like the crosses done in both mixed metals. Um, I like that it's primarily gold and then it has a little bit of silver. Love that. And then the next one is also by uh, Kurt Geiger London, uh, which is the Evil Eye. I like that. Very, very cute. And then the Nordstrom's necklace um, is, I think this is just really pretty. They have it in gold or and silver. Um, this will be something that I'm almost certain that they will have in store. Usually their Nordstrom brands, uh, jewelry-wise, they have in store. Um, and I just like the little uh, crystal or the little whatever faux diamond um, and I think it's really cute uh, I will probably get it in silver but I may get it in gold all right one handbag that I may may I want to look at it might be in the store might not I'll get it we'll see is the Rebecca Minkoff um, it's right here right here this one all right you guys that is it that is the first video for the Nordstrom's anniversary sale. That's my picks, the things that I would recommend, the things that I am getting. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, take a minute, hit a thumbs up, save the video so that you can go back to it. Start your, um, your list now, your wish list. You can, you can go in, start your wish list. You know, I'll be right here trying things on with you and uh, letting you know my opinion. As always, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you soon. Bye, guys.